All right, here we have some wildlife, or almost wildlife, or I just know it's a Terrapin Carolina turtle when it needs some work. If you'll notice there at the right ear, there's some swelling. That means this guy's got a right oral abscess. And we're going to go ahead, and I'm just cleaning it up now, getting it soaked. We're going to actually go ahead and uh, do some surgery in a few minutes. But this is one of those cases where the client wants it to go back to his home, but doesn't want to pay for surgery. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to fix turtle. But as to who gets it, the wildlife people for rehabbing and releasing, or he'll pay some price for it. We just haven't gotten that far yet because, you know, I have partners. This is a hospital. It is a business. can't be for free, but we do our best. Anyway, so if it... Uh, the client brings them in, and they want to back, go back into racing where they got them from, which is actually cool. Very, very good idea. Fine. What's the way I'd like to see it happen is, you know, get them back where they come from. But at some point in time, someone's got to pay the bills. So with that in mind, that's what we're at for now. All right. A minute of turtle in tow. As we're setting up for our surgery with much laughter in the background, there's our anesthetic, there's a needle to deliver it, there's our expensive turtle restraint device, and here's our cold pack. <laughs> All right, so we're getting set up. Turtle says, get me off this restraint device. It's cruel and in turtle punishment. <laughs> in, yeah, in the herpetile punishment. Get me off. Get me off. Make them stop. The use of a simple cup. <laughs> Here's the bad news. Eventually they learn that if they start jumping around, they'll actually fall off of it. But we're not going to let this guy do that long enough, so he's not going to figure this out. That's what it looked like with full procedure. Notice how he's still moving around to pull his head in. Hopefully, if all goes well and hit the vein correctly, the next picture you see will be his head slowly falling out, hanging down really limply, and then I'll be able to go ahead and do the surgery. All right, that's it for now. Later. <laughs> all right, here we are approximately three minutes later. My buddy's gotten his IV injection, and he's just starting to relax. Oh. I just don't care. I'm not caring. Woohoo. Woohoo. Gravity sucks. <laughs> now, I'm going to clean up a spot, prep him for surgery, and then we're going to fix that. Oh, man. It's already starting to rupture. Yuck. Okay. Well, I don't have to make much of an incision. That's the good news. Okay, later. We're going? Like now? 3 2 one now? Or like 2-1 now? 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 <laughs> All right, um, here we have an oral abscess in a Terrapin Carolina. It already has started to rupture here, so some of it's already coming out. And there's the hole right there. I'm try, probably going to try to make this a tiny bit larger and use that same hole since it's the path of least resistance. Uh, get some of this stuff out of. Where is this infection? In his right ear. That's the actual eardrum right there itself. Normally it would look like that. Okay. 
I'm not really sure it's called the Eustachian tube in turtles or not, but the same thing would be uh, the equivalent of our Eustachian tube can actually get infected. And uh, once it gets into there, it can actually cause an inner ear infection. And of course, it can make its way through the eardrum and then in, into this area here. Or actually, this is the eardrum anyway. But, uh, so when these guys get these infections, it can sometimes be rather chronic. This guy, we tried a few antibiotic injections. And it hasn't seemed to have made much difference as far as that goes. We tried the path of least resistance. The bad news is because reptiles produce what's called insulated pus, which is like hard and cottage cheese, it doesn't, it wouldn't dissipate much like ours would. So sometimes you have to open these guys up and give them a flush. Good news is it's already on antibiotics. I think my hand's shaking more than yours is. That's a pig in the hall. Think it's almost ready. <laughs> <laughs> For you pig owners out there, <laughs> I don't do many of them because I hate the noise that they make. But to be really fair to pigs, they taste awesome. It's been the ongoing joke here for many years, so anyway, don't take it too personally. Just, just know that I, except for the noise, that we do surgeries, we do all kinds of stuff for them. And Dr. Ram will be our local pig expert. She's a pig doctor. All right, here we are post op. Hey, what's um, the iron mean? The iron what? Well, you have the resistance, the acceptable. Intermediate? Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. 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 So Before I was so rudely interrupted with a culturing sensitivity. Oh, you're the one that interjected into this conversation, dude. Oh, I don't think so. I was over here minding my own business. Oh, me, and, me and this turtle, minding our own business. You don't never mind our business. own business. So just take take your business elsewhere. No. <laughs> Woman gets in a birthday and then she thinks she like owns the place. Yeah, shaking is me laughing. All right, well, I got one playing on my ear, one playing in front of the camera, one's behind the camera. Anyway, welcome to my life. And somehow they're trying to show you the butt end of a thermometer. Oh, they're going to do a pig surgery. Maybe I should like do the turtle thing while the pig surgery is going on or pig procedure. Oh, just to let people know just how my torture is because I was making pig jokes a minute ago while doing the turtle. Okay, all right. So anyway, turtle here is waking up. <laughs> There's the procedure spot right there. Um, because it was already open and needed some drainage, I'm going to let that stay open. I'm uh, going to give him some more antibiotics and figure out where it's going to go, back to rehab or back to the client. That's a phone call I'm waiting to make. And other than that, so we look like post up. The swelling is uh, way less than it was. All right, that's it for now. Oh, I will do the pig thing, so we'll try to make this funny. This little pig went to market. This, this little pig stayed home. This little pig had roast beef, and this little pig had none. And this little pig went wee 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 all the way home. <laughs> Thank you.
And that's what a pig sounds like being caught and going almost under anesthesia. And this little piggy went wee, 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 all the way home. <laughs>